If you're in a season-long fantasy league that's not too deep, a quarterback streaming option might be Marcus Mariota. Greg, if he's available, what do you like about Mariota? Yeah, so in almost all my fantasy leagues this year, Maria, I pick Marcus Mariota as a second quarterback. If I could draft a veteran, a Matthew Stafford, a Matt Ryan, someone like that, I always backed it up with Marcus Mariota because just last year, he was a guy that was going in the top 10. We all expected a major breakout, and for whatever reason, it didn't happen. And one, as I said, for whatever reason, one of those reasons might have been the head coach and the offense just was too old school. It didn't work for Mariota. Mariota. That's all changed. Well, another reason might have been his health as well. Yeah, his health. He was seemingly never healthy. And now with Matt LaFleur as the offensive coordinator, with Mike Vrabel as the head coach, I believe this has all changed. But I think fantasy owners just want to look. They weren't confident having him as their starting quarterback on draft day. But in this matchup against a Miami team that is ranked 25th against the pass for opposing quarterbacks, Mariota may be a great start in week one. You may be dealing with some injuries. You may be dealing with a quarterback that whose matchup you simply do not like. That's where you can enter Mariota. I backed my teams up with Mariota, with Alex Smith, and with Dak Prescott. But Mariota may have the highest ceiling out of all of them. I love Marcus Mariota going forward, and I absolutely love him this week. Yeah, and even though he was a little shaky last season, you loved him in the playoffs too, Greg. Total gamer. Marcus Mariota, good option for week one if you need a streamer.